blessing for me, I do believe, is that I really develop, I feel like I really developed my relationship with Christ. Um, that I had always wanted one. I didn't, I just thought people who said they had one got lucky and, or prayed harder. Um, I didn't know, you know, that that was going to happen to me. And I really believe that's my biggest blessing. Well, the greatest blessing was something that I didn't expect at all. And that was the camaraderie that would develop between the group. At the end of the three years, I really felt like I was leaving a family. The only good thing was that we weren't really leaving. We just weren't going to meet every week like we, we had. But um, even, even right now, when I see those people, it's like seeing a member of the, the family because we became that, that close. And I didn't expect that at all, but it was a, a great blessing. I think that, that the overall blessing to me was to learn more about my faith, you know, about uh, here again growing up, I knew nothing really of the Old Testament. We just, you know, we weren't encouraged to read the Bible. And uh, it's been said that, you know, Christ was born a Jew, raised a Jew, and died a Jew. And if we don't know the history of what went into that, to his upbringing, then we can't really know, you know, what our faith entails. Because if you just stop at the Old Testament and even just stop at the New Testament, you stagnate. You've got to keep going forward. You have to keep learning in order to, uh, to improve yourself, to improve the church, uh, and improve your position with, with God. I would say everybody who is thinking about the Living Stones program, uh, give it a shot. It, it, yes, it is a commitment to it. You're going to have to to put forth, but you get out of it what you put into it. And if you're looking for something to to enhance your faith journey uh, and increase your increase your knowledge of the church and and, and all the components around it, and and do some ministry and, and help others, Living Stones is a great place to start. I would tell people if they are considering living stones, that it has been a very great blessing in my life. I not only had the opportunity to learn, I had the opportunity to learn in an environment where, where we could all interact with each other and learn from each other, share our comments, share our struggles, be of support to one another, at the same time gaining knowledge gaining experience in leading prayer services, um, learning more about our own personality styles and personality preferences, and how all these things help us interact with others. I think people are afraid to commit. I don't know if it's because they're afraid of change or the time commitment, but I don't think they should be. I think they ought to jump in.